Hey guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I want to show how to make social media post animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So, vectors from freepick.com, I will add download link and preview your files. Let's select these background objects and right mouse precoms add name background objects click ok back to main composition select the stars again make new composition and click ok back to again main composition and let's select this card let's link to hand select this finger let's link to again hand and select this hand layer go to solo and select palm behind icon let's move to here click station tool and press air for open rotation go to first second let's see okay nice i will try make rotate animation like this so make rotation keyframe and change rotation like this let's try change minus five go to 10 keyframe for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in the keyboard let's change this 5 again go to 10 keyframe select first keyframe copy past and select keyframes make easy let's see okay so i want to make endless animation with 3 keyframes and i will use loop expression let's hold alt click this time icon go to click play button property and loop out duration for add expression and for down expression click this empty area let's see okay nice endless animation with only three keyframes so let's close keyframe settings and unsolo click this icon let's see okay very nice and let's select this shadow let's link to hand layer okay not bad so select this finger let's go to solo and let's make a little animation for this main finger go to puppet pin let's add one puppet here one here and here here and here click session tool and let's open mesh one and open the form and let's select this main puppet we can see here this puppet name puppet pin 5 let's open here and let's unsolo let's change puppet like this go to 10 frame let's change puppet like this again go to 10 frame select first key frame ctrl c ctrl v select key frames make easy let's see okay so let's again make someone hold alt click this time icon Go to play button, property and loop out duration. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So, select these keyframes and let's right mouse, go to keyframe lesson and click time reverse keyframes. Let's see again. Okay, select keyframes, hold alt and move to right for slow animation. okay not bad and let's select this card go to solo and say palm behind move to anchor point here click station tool and unsolo let's press air make rotation keyframe go to here chain rotation like this and go to here say first keyframe ctrl c ctrl v select keyframes make easy Let's select this hand layer, press U for CK frames and make timing. Let's select chair frames, hold Alt, move to left. Let's see. Okay, let's make someone again. Hold Alt, click this rotate icon. Go to play button, property and loop out duration. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So let's close this keyframe settings and let's write here our text for text animation i will use animation composite 3 and this is plugin is free 
you can watch my video how to download and how to install animation composer 3 let's go to text and let's write here shopping Clicization tool let's move to here and change spacing let's change zero okay move to here and let's go to window open animation composer 3 let's open starter preset and open text animation animator characters and let's select this any effect for our text okay that's good let's click when we select this text layer click in and close composition let's see okay let's control d move to down this duplicate text let's change text and clicization tool change scale move to here and go to color select this eyedropper let's select this dark color and clicization tool let's see okay select is with card text let's move to right let's say again okay select these marks let's move to right for slow animation okay not bad so let's select these lines and delete let's open background and let's hide background line go to shape layers and let's make new shape layer like this clicization tool and go to fill click fill and select this none click ok go to stroke color let's select this white color and click ok change stroke width 10 okay nice and select the shape layer go to add and select trim pads open trim pads 1 and change end 0 make end shape frame and go to 7 second press N for select work area and change this 100 let's see okay select shape frames let's make easy let's say again okay not bad so let's go to effects presses search effect wave warp and select this wave warp let's use for background shape 4 and change pinning all edge let's see okay let's change wave height like this and this okay let's move to down okay not bad select this wave warp effect ctrl c and select other shape layers ctrl v let's see okay let's select this and let's move to down and background shape 2 let's move to left and background shape 1 move to here okay back to main composition let's see nice and select these background objects let's make simple animation for these shape layers select this background object 2 go to first second let's press p and hold alt click this time icon for open expression and let's write here wiggle one nine for done expression click again here let's see okay let's change this for fast animation to okay not bad this is random animation let's copy this expression ctrl c and select this background object 3 press p hold alt click here Control V and click here. Let's see. Nice. Let's try change this five and change this five and let's try change again this two. Okay. So and say this background object one. Press P. Hold Alt. Click here. Control V and let's see nice let's back to main composition okay not bad so open starts composition and select these all stars let's press t for open opacity 
and max star keyframe let's change 0 and go to 3 keyframe 1 to 3 change 100 go to 3 keyframe again 1 to 3 change 0 let's see okay and let's make random animations let's select all these stars go to edit and split layer let's delay it let's see okay and let's make random animation like this let's see okay and select these layers ctrl d let's move to up and move to right again ctrl d move to up and move to right okay again ctrl d move to up and move to right let's select all these stars ctrl d and move to up and move to right okay let's see nice let's close stars composition back to main composition and let's go to solo let's see okay let's control d this composition and move to right okay let's control d again move to right let's see okay let's press s change this scale okay nice let's unsolo and let's see okay very nice so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck